What's up, everybody? Today is Sunday, and it was a very nice day outside today for the most part. Uh, it was kind of cold this morning, but it warmed up decently to the point where I really didn't have to wear a shirt all day, so that was fun. Um, I'm going to get into these uh, articles that I looked up today, and then I will talk about my day, and then you can talk about your day in the comment section, as always. So, I looked up two articles today. Uh, that caught my attention. Uh, the first one I'm going to talk about, for you golf fans out there, uh, there's been some kind of debate over uh, Tiger Woods and his uh, two-stroke penalty. Uh, to explain this, for those of you who don't know, the story of it goes kind of like this. Well, they were playing in the Masters Tournament. Uh, Tiger took a shot. On, I don't remember which hole it was, but he took a shot and it, he hit the flagpole and it bounced too far off into uh, a pond or a lake or whatever. And uh, that was a one stroke penalty. And he had to redrop the ball as closely to his original position as possible. But instead of dropping it in his original position where he was going to hit it again, he dropped it back about two yards like from the hole backwards to uh, make it easier for him to take off of the shot and make sure it doesn't hit the flagpole again and go back into the water. Now apparently this is illegal in golf. You're not allowed to do that. And then Tiger says he didn't know that, but he admitted that he did it on purpose. So they reopened this investigation and called him back to the course on that Saturday morning, and they, you know, they did their thing with the yada yada, you did this, you did that, and uh, eventually he just said, you know, fuck it, I'm just going to do my thing, I'm going to finish playing, and, you know, no more questions are really asked, so this is kind of an open-ended thing, but I uh, just thought I'd kind of get into it, it was kind of interesting, because uh, Tiger's usually really good, but he's, last I heard he's doing terrible in the Masters, so for you golf fans out there, that's a little update on that. No, no, Toski, Toski. Okay. That's my, <laughs> my friend. He's a good friend of mine. Hans Waffles. Weirdo. Always talking when I'm trying to talk. It's rude. Anyways. So the second one uh, was about... It's like another suicide one, because apparently I'm obsessed with suicide stories. But, uh, so at this uh, Texas race, or this race in Texas, uh, NRA, they called the NRA 500, um, some guy apparently shot himself in the head after getting into it with some other fans or whatever, so he was arguing with some other fans about whatever it was that he was passionate about, and went into the infield next to a pickup truck, and right in the middle of everything, just, well, it was kind of, I say right in the middle of everything just because I say that, but it was towards the end of the race, and he just pop, took his head off, so, there's that, and, uh, you know, they were going to cover that race on Fox, with a certain, like, sponsorship package and whatever, and ads and whatnot, but they were like, yeah, just go ahead and not televise that or anything, because some guy, like, killed himself, so, and apparently, like, what is this, 2013, so it was five years ago, in 2008, at the same race, uh, so the same race five years ago, someone shot off a random bullet into the sky, and it came down through some chick's RV and hit her in the arm. Now, if you ask me, that's kind of that chick's just, just having some bad luck there, because of all of the things that bullet could hit as a stray bullet, it goes through the RV and hits her right in the arm. I call that being in the wrong place at the wrong time. So, shady for you. I uh, hope you're okay. Five years later, hope you uh, didn't have like die from that or anything from too much blood loss. Cause then, well, you'd be dead, and that would suck. So yeah, that's uh kind of the gist of what I found today on articles. Cause there really wasn't that much stuff that was important. I saw a whole bunch of stuff about uh, artists and stuff, and who wore it better between Katy Perry and. Uh, some other girl, I forget who it was. 
Selena Gomez, I think it was. Something about Justin Bieber, I kind of just skipped over that one. I was like, nope, nope, next. So, my day today was hectic. And uh, I got up at 9.30 today, and I waited for my grandfather to come pick me up to go to his house. I got to work with him on his back deck all day long. Uh, we had to replace a lot of uh, wood boards on his uh, deck, his patio area, because some of the boards were weak or whatever. So I got to carry wood all day. Face of the day, I'll kill you. So that's basically what I did until 4 o'clock, and then I played with all the kids in the neighborhood who were like, I'd say, 5 to 8 years old, and then there's one 12-year-old. So I, I usually just wrestle with them all, but today they had all their toys out and whatever, so I was just getting repeatedly pelted with plastic toys and hit with hockey sticks, and it, it just it was fun, but I mean, I mean look, 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 look. As my hands are just tore the fuck up. It looked worse earlier. I don't have hand lock. Other hand. Let me show you my light. This area right here. Big bump on it. It hurts like hell. And I have a concussion. I got smacked right in the jaw with a hockey stick. Didn't feel good. But it's all worth it. It's all good. Tomorrow, on the other hand, I have to go to... <clears throat> St. Vincent's Hospital to get a psychiatric evaluation to prove to my school that apparently, well, I mean, they want to, they want me to prove to them that I'm not a maniac and that I'm not going to go to school and kill everybody. So, in my opinion, this has really been taken too far over a joke on a Facebook status. But, you know, whatever. This is just basically a longer vacation for me, so what are you going to do? Play the game how I have to play. That's what I'm gonna do. Well, that was my day, and that's the beginning of my day tomorrow. I have to go do that psychiatric evaluation. They're probably gonna think I'm crazy anyways, so see how that goes. <laughs> and then I have to go help my grandfather with the rest of the deck because we didn't finish it today. So I get to do that, and then. I get to dump a whole bunch of mulch all over the ground and stuff, and then come home and I'll make another video. So, my life is just so interesting these days. So that's really all I have for today and most of tomorrow. Uh, post in the comments if you have any uh, anything to say about the articles that I went over today, or any related stories, opinions, facts. Things to say, questions, whatever. Have a good time in the comments section. There for you. Uh, hit that like button if you want to see more videos like this. and Punch the subscribe button. Let me know what you're watching. It's up there right above this right here. It's ugliness. Tell me about your day. Tell me about how beautiful you are. Throw me a response video with your beautiful face for however long I really don't care but I'll watch it till next time keep smiling you never know who's gonna take pictures see ya